Hey, Fusion Community Church, this is Pastor Fetter. Uh, just kind of touching base with you leading up to Sunday morning as we prepare to kind of move everything indoors in the morning at 9 and 11 and still offer the drive-in option at 5.30. So uh, the worship center is pretty well set to go, but I want to share with you something new that we're kind of adding this week as we'll be inside, knowing that, you know, everybody in light of what's been happening the last six months, everybody has different views, different perspectives on it, and, and often those perspectives are related to the context of each person's life. For those that are caring for elderly parents or those who have children with compromised immune systems or going through certain diagnosis or treatment or children with uh, asthma, those kinds of things. So we want to make it, we want to try to remove as many barriers as possible for people with menu options to select the worship time that works best for them. Now we know everybody has preferences, you know, some prefer the early morning service, the afternoon, some prefer the evening, but we're kind of getting a little more specific, trying to tie into people's needs and what makes them most comfortable and sometimes what makes you most comfortable may not be your preference of time. So starting this week at 9 a.m., we're gonna be inside, but throughout the entire building, masks are optional. In the bathrooms, in, in the foyer, in the worship center, we wanna encourage you to, to, to social distance yourself and be considerate of other people, um, but you don't have to wear a mask. And so for some, that's very problematic to wear a mask. And so that nine o'clock option is being provided. You are more than welcome to wear them. now. If you want to join the nine, if you want to come in the nine, we have on the wings, on the sides of the walls, you can kind of see these taped off areas, which are just kind of six foot by six foot spaces where you can kind of be off to the far sides. Uh, and, and if you're seated there, that's just kind of an acknowledgement to other people around you. You just want to kind of be spatial and you want to kind of have your own space. So those will be available in both the nine and 11 along both sides of the walls. Uh, you'll see kind of way over there, those boxes, those grids are on the floor as well. At the 11 a.m. worship, we're going to do mass required throughout the whole building. Children's ministry at Takuma Island, bathrooms, foyer, worship center. The only people that won't be wearing masks are those on the stage uh, who are speaking, praying, leading worship, and those in the sound booth that are communicating among themselves with the technical side of things, with the live stream and the sound and, and the slides. Um, as you know, it's kind of muffled sometimes when you're speaking quietly with the mask. So this gives them the freedom to communicate, and they're also distanced uh, far enough away from each other. Uh, to be safe there. And then at 5.30 we'll be outside unless in the event of rain we'll come inside and um, with the crowd we normally have on Friday at 5.30 we'll be able to spread out throughout the entire building. So that'll be mask optional as well if we have to come inside. Otherwise we'll be outside in the drive-in format. People can bring lawn chairs. We encourage you to bring your dinner. Um, but that's kind of what we're shooting for this Sunday. We could make adjustments and change things for the following week. But let me just summarize. 9 a.m. masks are optional. 11 a.m. masks are required throughout the entire building for the kids ministry as well through the entirety of the service, uh, just to give people a sense that, that would prefer that, to know that that's gonna be the condition. Everybody's kinda welcoming that and loving their neighbor that choose to attend the 11 a.m. service, and then the 5.30 will be outside in the drive-in. So, you have lots of menu options, lots of things to decide, and lots of things to talk about. Uh, if you have any questions about this, feel free to shoot me an email, andrew.fetter at fusioncommunity.church. Uh, you can always email the office as well, which is office at fusioncommunity.church, and I'll get that as well. Otherwise, look forward to seeing you this Sunday as we continue our series, We Can't Stay Here Anymore. Bye.